Hey, Steve McGrew here. Out at the store today, I saw a kid and his mom get into it. He wanted a fidget spinner, and she said no. I thought, good for her. Nice to see a kid get told no. That needs to happen much more often. Then the little McNugget monster went into full meltdown mode. And instead of whooping that kid into a new one, she caved in and bought him that spinner. Oh, just to shut him up. No, 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 no. Guess who trained who in this kennel? Your kid needs a fidget spinner? No, they need chores. Can't sit still? Go clean your room. Feeling restless? Go pick up dog poop. Got energy to burn? Cut the grass. Parents, stop raising lazy, self-entitled pussies. Oh, but that would give kids a work ethic, responsibility, and a sense of accomplishment. That would make all of their participation trophies worthless. And we can't have that. Yeah, we can. That would erase all the hard work of liberal teachers and government. They've worked hard to program weakness and controllability into these kids. That would mean parents would have to start parenting and stop raising lazy, entitled brats. Yeah, God forbid parents start raising their kids to be productive members of society instead of these whiny little crybaby snowflake sugar cookies that are protesting in the streets and think everything should be given to them without even working for it. That lawnmower that's sitting in the garage has blade on it. Yep, has a blade on it. It spins. There's a spinner, you little fidget spinner cream puff. Go cut the grass. That's just my opinion. I could be wrong, but I'm probably not. See you guys.